Since 1971, National University has been dedicated to meeting the needs of hard-working adults by providing accessible, affordable, achievable higher education opportunities. National University offers four-week classes, programs for working adults and multiple scholarship opportunities. 75 plus degrees, credentials and certificates. Scholarships available, year-round enrolment, take classes online or on-site, monthly course starts, adult focused for 50 years, transfer credits any time, locations across California, veteran-founded non-profit, convenient course schedules, financial aid opportunities, military tuition discounts. So, for the teaching credential program you must take 9 courses plus 4 months, 600 instructional hours of student teaching coursework which equal total 13 months to complete. And for Master of Education in Inspired Teaching and Learning with Teaching Credential Program 9 courses plus 4 months 600 instructional hours of student teaching coursework plus 3 more courses equaling total 16 months to complete. Now we check the requirement to get the admission. Step 1. Initial Credential Requirements E-Form 1. Proof of negative tuberculosis or a TB risk assessment with certificate of completion. 2. Proof of an attempt to pass or proof of passing or proof of scheduling subject matter competence CSET. 3. Basic Skills Assessment see best, or see the option to qualify in the form of Internal 41 BSR Proof of Basic Skills Not Required but if you have passed already it is best to submit the Internal 41 BSR and to support documents to avoid program delays in the future. 4. COVID-19 Liability Release 5. Proof of fingerprint clearance, verified with a certificate of clearance visible on the CTC website. Once you are accepted for admission, you will be assigned Academic Advisor for your support. Initial Credential Requirements e-forms that are missing requirements will be denied and you will be required to resubmit the e-form for reconsideration. As a result, the scheduling of your courses could be delayed. Inspired Teaching and Learning ITL, coursework will have embedded fieldwork. To participate in these courses, you must have an approved Initial Credential Requirements eForms on file. All candidates are required to maintain a 3.0 GPA in all credential coursework. D, F and U grades are not accepted. All coursework for the Inspired Teaching and Learning Credential Programme must be taken in sequence. Step 2. Introductory Core Course The following course is required by all who participate in the Inspired Teaching and Learning with a preliminary multiple or single subject teaching credential program and cannot be waived. Introductory Core Course ITL 600 Step 3. Foundation Core Courses An approved Initial Credential Requirements eForm must be on file to complete these courses. Foundation Core Courses ITL 604 ITL 606 ITL 608 Step 4 Methods Courses the basic skills and subject matter competency requirements must be on file to schedule methods coursework. You will be provided with a student teaching placement request form via the Student Message Centre upon the scheduling of ITL 608. This form must be returned to your local credential programme specialist in order to initiate the clinical practice placement process. For multiple subject credentials, take the following courses. 
ITL510, ITL512, ITL516, ITL518, ITL530. For single subject credentials, take the following courses. ITL520, ITL522, ITL526, ITL528, ITL530. In addition to the requirements listed above, the following credential requirements must be completed and verified with your credential program specialist in order to be eligible for student teaching. Please get in touch with the Credentials Department to obtain specific student teacher deadline information. Student teaching request form must be on file at least 90 days before desired start date, current account balance, all core and methods courses with a minimum GPA of 3.0, D, F and U grades are not accepted. Student Teaching Coursework and CalTPA 2.0 Cycles Student Teaching Coursework signifies a minimum of 600 instructional hours, 16 to 18 weeks full-time. The following courses receive satisfactory or unsatisfactory grades and are not calculated as part of your GPA. ITL 550A, Student Teaching A, ITL 550B, Student Teaching B, ITL 551A, Student Teacher Seminar A, ITL 551B, Student Teacher Seminar B. CalTPA is composed of two instructional cycles based on the sequence of the plan, Teach and Assess, Reflect and Apply. CalTPA instructional cycles 1 and 2 will be completed during your seminar courses alongside student teaching. The cost of CalTPA is $150 per submission for a minimum total cost of $300. You will submit your CalTPA cycles through the CTC or Pearson web-based platform. If you are doing your multiple subject credentials, you will take the RICA exam to meet the requirements. Step 5. Concentration courses for those seeking the Master of Education. Choose any three from the following. The emphasis in English Language Learner. ITL 660. ITL 662. ITL 664. Note. Courses for the emphasis in English Language Learner Master of Education may not be taken until after you have completed your methods courses. Emphasis in Inspired Teaching Practices ITL 690, ITL 692, ITL 694 Emphasis in Social Emotional Learning ITL 670, ITL 672, ITL 674. Emphasis in Critical Thinking. ITL 680, ITL 682, ITL 684. Step 6. Credential Recommendation Requirements. In addition to the requirements listed, candidates must complete the following requirements in order to exit the programme and be recommended for the preliminary credential. Verification of meeting US Constitution requirement. Multiple subject candidates only. Passage of the Reading Instruction Competency Assessment, RICA. Possess a minimum of 3.0 GPA in credential coursework. D, F and U grades are not accepted. Zero account balance. Valid adult, child and infant CPR. Passage of CalTPA cycles 1 and 2. Meet with credential program specialist to complete credential recommendation request. CAL. Step 7. 
credential recommendation process. Your credential recommendation request will be reviewed by National University Credential Technicians who process the application, confirm credential eligibility and submit a recommendation to the state. You will receive an email notification to go online and pay for the credential. After payment is confirmed, you will receive an email confirmation from the CTC that your document has been granted. You can look up your credential document on the CTC website at www.ctc.ca.gov. This video is not sponsored and is only for informational purposes. National University is one of the great places to start your education. The staff and members are always available to help you reach your education goals. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe. Thank you.